week off to a, a rather long start on Monday and Tuesday nights, both on a couple of different bills. There is. We came in Monday and stayed here till 3 in the morning working on a pro-life bill, was not able to get it passed. The minority party filibustered and could not get it passed, so it's laid over on the formal calendar to be brought up again at a later time or can be, and then came back the next day with another pro-life bill and stayed till 10 o'clock that night and was unable to get that passed. And so that got put on the informal calendar. There again, that can be brought up again at a later time and then moved on. So uh, that took a lot of our week, passed a supplemental budget this year to allow things to go ahead and be paid for the rest of the year. And that's customary. And this year, we made it half of what it had been in previous years. So that was a big step forward to where we kind of know more where we're at financially. Other than that, not a lot going on. The bills that were in question earlier, one of those I know affects, it's more of a, it's been presented at least more of, is more of a First Amendment issue than is anything. That it is, and that's what people think that it is. It's kind of a First Amendment freedom of speech. If it's a good bill, I would have voted for the bill had it got out Senator Wallingford's bill. Doesn't mean it won't come up at a later date. There was some talk of a compromise on it, and sometimes when you lay a bill over on the informal calendar, that gives both parties a chance to sit down and say, we'll give you this if you'll give us that, and we can work out something. And a lot that goes on up here is due to negotiating, compromising, and just because they, one party's a minority party doesn't mean they shouldn't have any voice in legislation. They represent 180,000 people just like I do, and they have their own different areas, and it's maybe a St. Louis issue versus a rural issue, and so you try and compromise, and they say politics are to compromise, and sometimes that happens. And as long as you don't compromise your principles, it's okay to compromise on different issues, but not your principles, and that's what I look at when it comes to compromising. Yes, I can compromise on this issue, that issue, but never on my principles. House Bill 14, the supplemental budget, also on its way to the governor now with three months left in the current fiscal year? Yes, just three months left in the current fiscal year, and this fills in the revenue until that time. It involved, I said only, but it involved $43 million of general revenue. Most of the rest of it was federal money and allows us to draw down that federal money to go ahead and complete that. A lot of it goes to social services and health and senior services, so that's where a lot of that money goes to. Desi will have some of it in there because of school enrollment increasing, decreasing programs, et cetera, like that, but most of it is federal money. Passed a lot of other bills, but nothing of any significance. We are working hard. Like I say, we were here till 3 in the morning one night and till 10 the next night. We are working hard trying to get things done. We aren't doing any highway namings, but most of the bills we're bringing up are trying to be good, strong legislation that's going to help Missouri move forward in the right path with jobs and economic growth. And only five weeks now left. There is just five weeks left. It goes fast. We've still got the budget to do. The budget for 18, which actually starts July the 1st of this year. I sit on appropriations committee, so we've been told that after we have session, there shall be about six hours of budget talks every night on appropriations. And so we'll try and get that out. That's going to take quite a bit of time once we get that out and get it on the floor. There's a number of important issues we feel very important to the growth of Missouri that have got to come up. So time's going to start running short. We always run out of time, and that's not all bad sometimes.